welcome to Linux Help Tutorial. I am going to explain about how to update PHP and CentOS Web Panel. The current PHP version is 5.4.45. Here you can see the version. Now we can see how to update the PHP version. Now select the PHP settings and select the PHP selector. Here you can see the available PHP versions for CentOS Web Panel. Now I'm going to update the PHP 5.4 to 5.6. Now select the PHP 5.6 and click Start Compiler. Now you can see the message the compiler has started. Now it is installing the dependency packages. Now you can view the process using the following command. Now paste the command in the terminal and give enter. This process will take some time. Now the build process is completed. Now we can see how to update the PHP. Now select the PHP version switcher and select the PHP version that you need to update. The, I'm going to update it to 5.6.24. Now click next. Now enable the PHP IMAP and select start compiler in background now the process is running on background to view the process you can use the following command and paste the command and give enter now you can see the background process that is running this will take some time now the compiler process is completed now here you can see the following procedure need to be done here after installation you need to add the Include path in the php.ini file. Now open the terminal. Now open a new tab. Now we need to locate the php.ini file. Locate php.ini. Here you can see the configuration file for PHP. Now we need to open the file. Vim. The file name. Now give enter. Now search the include path. Include underscore path and Enable the include path line and add the path of the php.ini file. Here's the path and copy this path and paste it here. Now save the file and exit. Next, you need to run the sh tool to install the par.par file. Now change the directory to newly created php configuration. It is php-5.6.24 and copy this now change the directory now list the files here you can see the sh tool now run the command sh tool install the par.par you need to mention the full location of the par file now we can locate the par.par file and here's the full path you need to mention the old version file now delete this and replace it with the full location in front of sh tool you need to add the dot slash to execute it now give enter the command is executed in the next step you need to add the symbolic link for the par file now run the following command to link the file for that you need to change the directory to the following location now give enter and now run the link command to create the symbolic link now the link is created now the php update process are completed now we can restart the apache web server now select the dashboard and restart the apache web server and now we can see the php version has updated to 5.6.24 from 5.4 the php version is successfully updated in centos web panel we can see more about the centos web panel in the next video Thank you for watching.